What's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I have January recap for you guys. This is the last one I need to update and the next one for the February will be uploaded once the month is over. Make sure to stay until the end of this video because I have an announcement that you're going to be very happy about. It. Let's not waste any time and get into the video. Alright, so as always, let's start with not activated trades. We had NZD USD, USD CHF, Euro USD, CHF JPY, XAU USD, which is gold. These were trades that were not active due to the rules that you wanted to see before confirming the entry. Then we got break even trades that this time we had no break even trade. It was either losing trade or winning or not active. We had five trades that were um, 20 pips stop loss and they were all stopped out. As you can see on the screen, there was three of them AUD based and two of them were Euro based. And then we had USC JPY with 15 pips stop loss and then a couple other trades like USD CAD, GU, US 30 or gold that had 30 pips of stop loss. Well, GU and gold and US 30, um, the 30 pips is not really that much for it. Then we had winning trades. We had Euro USD two trade this week. We had actually more, but in the slide, you can see two of them. Um, one of them had 80 pips of stop loss, one of them had 40. This was a um, very simple and easy one because um, trap of resistance up here, pretty obvious. DMA was also stating buy uh, tp1 was almost certain that will be hit and tp2 was also certain because if price wanted to reverse it had to continue and trap buyers up here so that was an easy 80 pips and in this one we took a very uh, short trade of 40 pips daily structure for euro usd on five minute time frame we had another Euro USD trade that was a reversal trading. This one was a 215 pips. It pushed to the TP1 for us and then came back to the entry. But we gave also another alert when the player was ready to push for the second TP. And one of the cleanest trade for this month was Euro JPY 150 pips to the DMA in forever. We had a what the money do pattern here. So you guys that watching it from YouTube are not part of my students. You already can have access to this book for free and also mini trap course that you can go and watch it. The link will be in the description. Euro GBP, we had two attempt for reversal trading, which did work all the way to TP1, 50 pip on one of the attempts and 60 pip for the next one. We had a trade on Eurocat um, trap from previous week and the resistance that was created during the week and it was an 80 pip trade. And also US dollar Canadian, it was 150 pips analysis. In terms of trading it, we did try it in um, Thursday and it didn't reach the TP and then we had another try on Friday that played out again up to high of yesterday. So another 50, 60 pip. I personally don't hold trade on weekend so I wasn't all the way into this high because it did move in Sunday Monday but overall the analysis played out for 150 pips and then we had another USD cat trade um, that had 60 pips it was kind of an induction trading after trapping the high of Friday we took this trade and that was a 60 pip and we had a USD CHF attempt for reversal as well. This one also played all the way to TP1, not TP2, and that was 150 pips. USD CHF is a bit crazy. If you can't get entry before the move happens, you almost have no chance to get a safe, secure entry when move actually is, you know, running. Then we had um, USD JPY trade again. With the 210 pips take profit that was a smashed. As you can see, we had um, a trap here, which I marked it also here at the after. You can see, start of the week, we had a trap off the Friday's high and an induction back down. This will trap lots of sellers. This was the last induction we were expecting it to the zone. And that was our entry and 210 pips 
This analysis was sent by uh, GPG UK, which is one of our mentors. GBP USD, this one also was a very clean trade. 135 pips, reversal. We had a Friday, Sunday, Monday trap, and then Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday reversal and breaking the high of previous week. That was also very clean trade. It gave us um, a chance of entry for the move and then another pullback and give us another chance after TP1 was hit. And finally, we had DXY analysis by Elvin. And this one also was around 1800 points. We don't trade this, but we use it towards our analysis. So that was also a successful analysis here. Now, as you can see, we had 235 pips in losses, 1,380 pips in wins, which brings the total to 1,145 pips for the January. <laughs> so congratulations to everyone in Analysis Channel who took these trades. And that was it for this month recap. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed and learned something new. As I mentioned, I have an announcement for you guys and that's a giveaway for my YouTube subscribers. At the end of each month, including February, I'm going to choose one of the subscribers from the comment section and give him one of my courses absolutely free of charge. The courses would be random every month. So this can be golden eyes, bootcamp or even dma hack so if you want to be part of this giveaway make sure to subscribe to the channel and leave a comment every time i post a new video that's it guys i'll see you in the comment section peace